Good morning! When I ask the question, why do your customers buy from you? I often hear the answer, they trust me. Trust. How do you sell that? How do you show yourself to be a trustworthy individual? After all, it's impossible to prove to someone that you are as good as your word until you've been given the chance to prove to someone that you're as good as your word, right? Consider the importance of this issue. As discussed in a recent short attention span webinar, if you are not the printer of record, you are selling into fear. They don't know you. They don't believe in you. They don't trust you. In order for a prospect to become a customer, you have to give them sufficient reason to switch. Now, do you think price is enough? Well, even a lower price can work against you as it might cause the client to be leery of a difference. As in any relationship, building trust is a step-by-step -step process. You need to prove yourself worthy by doing the little things right. For example, if you tell a prospect that you'll check in in two weeks, check in in two weeks. If you promise to stick something in the mail, stick something in the mail. These little kept promises add up and trust is developed. It helps, by the way, if you slip in little reminders like, as promised, I am calling you, or I told you I'd call this week and here I am keeping my promise. In general, salespeople don't have the best track record. You are fighting against an unfair and undeserved stereotype that would have everyone believing that we are all six degrees of the fictional character Herb Tarlick. Google it. Or worse, trust is a tough sell that it might just be the most important sale you make in your efforts to find new customers. Nice shirt, huh?